Hey there, I'm Ike with Big Tech Swordance, and today we're doing a comparison video between a genuine Modlite 18650 weapon mounted light and a fake one from China. So we're gonna give you a quick little overview on these and kind of what some differences are and how you can potentially spot a fake. So I've seen good ones, I've seen bad ones. This one's actually pretty decent, at least from an external dimension standpoint. So taking a look at color, first thing we'll touch on, I'm not gonna harp too big on this because anodizing, especially on the FDE variants, will vary greatly from batch to batch. So this genuine Mod Light product here on the right is a little bit lighter in shade. This one's more of like a goldish, kind of like a burnt bronzes almost. The variation in color can is gonna is gonna be different from batch to batch. This is the real one, this is the fake one. Obviously different colors, but it, that can definitely happen. Another thing we'll point out is the font on these two. I mean, you can see that the, the logoing is almost identical. This one's a little bit bigger, and then where it says PLH V2, and then the cage code, very, very similar fonts. This one might be a little bit larger of a font, but they did a really good job on that. Now this one says dual fuel, this one doesn't. There's definitely plenty of other genuine heads that won't say dual fuel on it, but will be genuine. Anyways, moving on, I wanna take a look at the diode here on the head. We'll go ahead and take this off real quick. So the diodes on these, that's an easy way to tell. I don't know if you'll be able to see it here on camera, but the genuine one is more of a, of a square diode. This one also has a square, but it has like a rounded bulb on the inside. And again, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that, but if you compare them side by side, you'll definitely notice a difference between them. Another thing I wanna talk about is this internal ring. This allows you to disassemble the light head. The genuine one here is black. This one is anodized to match the head. I've seen genuine ones from Mod Light both ways. So there are some that might be anodized FDE, some might be that black anodized. So that's not necessarily a dead giveaway, but I think all new production ones are black. I'm sure somebody will correct me with if I'm wrong, but I definitely have seen genuine Mod Light heads that have a matched internal ring right there. Another thing while we're on the head is back here on the circuit. So you'll notice here, on the genuine one, there's nothing exposed. On the fake one, there's a lot of exposed circuitry here. The soldering is different. The coil here is, is, a, is different as well. This one's more of a goldish, orangish color. This one's just straight silver. When you're comparing them side by side, you can definitely, definitely tell a difference. Going over to the scale, we'll take a look here. So the genuine one, this one is weighing in at just about two ounces, a little bit over two ounces. And the fake one here, this one comes in at 1.4 ounces. So about a, about a half an ounce difference, give or take, between the, between the real one and the fake one. Another thing I do wanna to touch on is the lug dimensions on this fake one. So if you're, you're using a scout mount that has protected lugs, basically where the lugs on this mount will go into it, these are a little bit too wide. They'll barely go in. It takes a lot of force to push it in there but it is a critical dimension that the exceeded and it is a little bit wider on this particular one. I don't know if the other ones are gonna be that wide or not. Another thing I wanna take a look at here is the tail caps. So here on the, on the genuine one here on the right, you'll notice this is like a silverish color, the opposite of what the, the, the springs were on the, um, on the head. This one's more of like a really shiny gold. This one's also a lot longer. You'll notice that this one is quite a bit shorter. Definitely a different length here between the genuine and the fake one. And then also looking in there at the actual mechanism inside the tail cap, you can see this one is completely different. It's black. There's a lot more going on. This one is just basically, you know, completely encased in white plastic. But that, that's some differences there. The clickiness on them, they feel pretty similar. Like. If I was testing these two, I don't think I could tell just based on the tactile feel from the button itself. So they actually did a pretty good job on in that respect. Everything else on these, as far as like, um, you know, the machining and the dimensions and everything and you know, how it looks aesthetically, um, it's really, really hard to tell just by looking at it from the outside without taking a look at the head, taking it apart and looking at the, uh, the internals and stuff. Well, anyways, that's the differences between a genuine mod light 18650 weapon mounted light and a fake one from China. Hopefully you found this informative and hopefully it helps prevent you from buying a counterfeit product. If you have any other differences that I might have left out, please let me know here in the comments. We really look forward to hearing from you. And if this helped you in any way, um, we really appreciate it. If you can give us a subscribe and share this, I think that's about it. We will see you next time.